after all these years it's finally happening. Bleach Season 2 was announced and will be out in 2021 and will adapt Thousand Year Blood War arc. Sadly, a premiere date is not revealed. The Thousand Year Blood War arc introduced Yuak, the strongest villain in the franchise. The character brought with him numerous followers and a surge of battle scenes. The announcement didn't mention anything about international distribution or if there will be a dub, so we will have to wait and see. With nearly 20 volumes of content, the wait will be worth it as it will be a long season, because the last arc is about one third of all manga. And with this news, I want to spoil a little bit of the new season for you, for no reason. So if you don't want to hear or see it, turn off the video. I want to tell you about all captains uh, who was died in the bleach. Not uh, only in uh, last arc, but overall. Genjusai Yamamoto was the captain of the first division in the Gotei 13 and also the captain commander of the whole Gotei 13. He was tricked by Yuak, who stole his Bankai and killed him by dissecting from his shoulder to his waist, and then unleashing an onslaught of Reishi Blast on Yamamoto and completely obliterates Yamamoto's body. The only remains of the battle the Gotei 13 could recover was the scorched and broken Ryujin Jaka. Jushiro Kitake was the captain of the 13th division in the Gotei 13. For most of his life, he hosted Mimihagi, the right arm of the Soul King, in his body. When Yuak absorbed Mimihagi, the darkness emanating from Ukitake's mouth is pulled into the sky, leaving Ukitake to collapse and die. Retsu Nohana, formerly known as Yachiru Nohana, was the former captain of the 4th division in the Gotei 13. She was one of the oldest and most experienced captains and was Soul Soshiti's best healer, as well as the first person to wield the name Kenpachi. Unohana fights Zaraki to unlock his full potential by dealing a lot of damage to him and then healing him up. After Zaraki unlocks his full power, thanks to her brutal guidance, she was impaled by him and died happily knowing she was fulfilled her duty. Sajin Kamamura is the former captain of the 7th division, and he didn't die actually. He used the humanization technique and became a human, receiving a big power up to win his fight. But in the end, he transformed into a wolf as the consequences of using the humanification technique. Kaname Tosen was the captain of the 9th division of the Gotei 13 until he betrayed Soul Soshiti. Later he became a hollow and got killed by Shuhei Hisagi and Kamamura. If you want to see more Bleach video, comment down below, like this video and subscribe for more. I'm out. Bye.